we're going to the porcelain china factory and uh, I've never been there and it's supposed to be a really nice city so uh, I decided to plug it because I'm weird like that <laughs> yeah he knows <laughs> okay factory and have you seen the prices yeah if we <laughs> if, if we break it we are gonna pay for this My but they are really really cute I have to say. I really like this one. We are inside the porcelain museum in Meissen and there are some things that you wouldn't believe are made of porcelain. <laughs> like this thing, right, this, right behind me. And even though the museum is not particularly huge, it's kind of maybe average size, there are so many cute and not so cute kitchen things that I sometimes like, sometimes I don't, but they are definitely, uh, the museum is definitely worth seeing. Now we are walking from the factory to the castle to see the city from there and I'm really enjoying this trip so far. No one has got killed, no one has got injured, no one broke any china, which is a, which is always a success on a school trip. The castle was, was nice, but we didn't go inside the cathedral because we just don't have time to visit everything. And now we are going to the main square to have something to eat and have some coffee. And my friend is trying to speak English with the kids and only, only a few are actually <laughs> up to it. <laughs> So now we are having some real food. I mean, have you seen it? Real food. So Brian, how did you like the food? It was delicious. The potatoes were amazing. With little bits of bacon and onion mixed in them. It was great. So, so uh, we are now happy and <laughs> satisfied and we are going to Moritzburg now from Meissen. Uh, it's a little bit chilly actually. It's around 2019 maybe even, but it's That's okay. Nice. I'm actually I'm really enjoying this because I've been sweating for a month already, and this is Tell like the, <laughs> this is the weather I I prefer. Okay. See you soon so too for soon. coffee. <laughs> What I did with my husband in Amsterdam, he wouldn't like lead me like this. Okay, so we are in Moritzburg. I'm walking backwards so you can actually see the castle behind me. And Moritzburg is famous 
for its architecture and really beautiful parks and ponds around the, the place but it's famous in popular culture in the Czech Republic and the rest of the Europe because a very 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 extremely popular <laughs> fairy tale movie was filmed here it's called The Three Wishes for Cinderella and they play it every Christmas uh, on Czech TV and in Norway I heard so <laughs> uh, this is why we are we are actually here not because of the architecture because but because the kids are supposed to know the the fairy tale I'm not sure about it because it's quite old already but maybe <laughs> so I have to say that the Kurfürst really know how to live the castle looks beautiful and there's a really 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 huge park and I really like the water all around here they say that they used to make parties that would be um, just people having fun and uh, and the couple and the hostess and host would be hunting in the woods and the guests would just watch them hunting and then probably they would eat what they what they what they had hunted so yeah decadent to <laughs> No, I, I was just about to say that every period has its um, entertainments. <laughs> <laughs> this is the staircase where Cinderella lost her shoe in the movie. And all the kids were trying the shoe on. And actually one guy fit yeah. the shoe. So we have a Cinderella boy <laughs> in our school. I really like this place a lot. It would be nice to come here for a whole day and just to have some food or just to, you know, hang out because it's a romantic place. I love it. The Cinderella story is, you know, it's the fairy tale that I watched when I was a kid, so it makes it a little bit more, even more romantic. This is probably going to be a very short vlog because I forgot to vlog the coffee. I forgot to vlog a lot of things, but uh, it was a really nice trip. And uh, now I'm back in Prague, going home actually from the school. The kids are going home as well. We were lucky we escaped one hot day in Prague and, and uh, enjoyed a nice trip to Germany and uh, just a laid back summer day, summer Monday. So the school the school term ends this week and then I'm going to have my summer holiday and I'm going to Spain. So this is all lovelies. Thank you for watching me. Thank you for watching my vlog and see you soon, I hope. Bye!